Hey guys, so today I'm going to be going through my morning as well as my nighttime skincare routine with you. So let's begin. So I guess we better start off with the type of skin that I have. So I have very, very sensitive skin, which means I have a lot of redness, especially around my cheeks as well as my nose area. And I also have very dry skin, like especially in the winter, my skin is literally a desert. So all the products that I'm going to be using today are geared for dry and sensitive skin. So first let's start off with my morning routine. Now I like to keep my morning skincare routine pretty simple because obviously it is the morning and I don't want to go through 7 billion steps in order to get my face clean. So I pretty much like to just stick to the bare essentials in the morning. So for my face wash, I love the Fresh Soy Face Cleanser. This is the most gentle face wash that I've come across. It's not drying at all and it also just really does the job really well. So I just wash my face and dry it off and then I apply my favorite day cream. This is the Kiehl's Ultra Facial Cream. It's so hydrating and it absorbs very, very quickly. So I could apply my makeup right after it. And it is probably one of the best face creams that I've ever used. It's done wonders for my skin. Next, I love using an eye cream. I find eye creams are very helpful because they make my makeup go on a lot smoother and they also just hydrate my under eyes. And I feel like taking care of your under eyes is very important, especially in your 20s, because you want your eyes to be in good shape when you're older. So the Kiehl's Avocado Eye Cream is my favorite, so I just apply that in patty motions underneath my eyes as well as around my lips because the skin around your lips is just as thin as the skin that's around your eyes. So now I like to apply a lip mask. This is the Bite Lip Mask. I just bought this and I'm obsessed with it. It is so thick and moisturizing and amazing to apply right in the morning to really keep your lips really nice and moisturized. And that's pretty much all I do in the morning. I keep it nice and simple, but it does the job. Next is my nighttime routine. So my nighttime routine, I go a little bit more in depth, I would say. So I just put my hair up, of course, get it out of the way, put on my mint headband, of course, and then I just go in and I start to take off my makeup. So I love using these Neutrogena gentle uh, makeup removing wipes. I love these because it takes off the majority of my makeup. It doesn't burn my skin since my skin is so sensitive. I do find that some makeup wipes do burn my skin and these don't and I just pretty much use this to take off the majority of my makeup like I said. Now to take off the remainder of my makeup, I love using coconut oil because it literally takes off everything, even waterproof mascara. And I also find that because coconut oil is so moisturizing, it helps my lashes as well as my brows grow stronger. I really have noticed a difference in the last six months in the growth of my lashes as well as my brows. So I pretty much just massage it all over my face and then wipe it off with a warm washcloth. And you're gonna see how much makeup is still left over my face. So I would definitely recommend not just sticking with a makeup wipe and going in with something else to really get everything off. And then I even go in with my face wash once again just to make sure that my face is squeaky clean. Now, sometimes I like to exfoliate. I didn't that day, but I do like to once in a while, and this Soy Face exfoliant is my favorite because it's super gentle. Now, sometimes after I remove my makeup, I like applying a DIY face mask. Now, this face mask is my favorite because it moisturizes my skin like no tomorrow, and it is perfect for the winter. So I love putting in honey as well as turmeric. Both of these are very, very good for the skin. Also, of course, coconut oil. And by the way, I pretty much just eyeball all these ingredients. I don't really have like a set amount of what I put in, but I always put in a half an avocado as well as half of a banana. And I also like putting in some oats because oats are super calming for the skin. I blend everything up and it should look something like this. Looks a little bit gross, but I'm telling you it's amazeballs. Now, whether I put on a mask or not, I always go in with my Holy Grail Night Cream. It's actually not even a cream, it's an oil. It's the Kiehl's Midnight Recovery Concentrate. This has saved my skin this winter. I'm not joking, guys. The dry patches on my face has completely disappeared after using this stuff. I pretty much just pat it all over my skin and it absorbs so quickly. And then I apply my eye cream again, as well as my lip mask, just to make sure that they're gonna be nice and hydrated throughout the night. And then once I do that, I'm pretty much done with my face. But I am not done yet. At night, I love putting on some cream. So this is a brand new cream that I just got. It's from Kiehl's. It is the Honey and Milk Cream, and it is so moisturizing, and I'm obsessed with it. So I pretty much just put it everywhere. And then once I do that, I'm pretty much done. So that is it for my winter skincare routine. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up if you did. And of course, subscribe to my channel if you're not subscribed already. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.